Hey, what's up everybody? And welcome to another Perfumery Basics video. And in today's video, we're going to take a look at diluting raw Benzoin Absolute. Now, Benzoin Absolute, if you order it raw, it's going to come into, it's gonna come as a, like a rock format. And just to give you an idea of what it looks like, here's a little sample. So yeah, they, they actually come into, they look like little uh, pebble-sized rocks and some of it's crushed, some of it's not. Uh, but so in today's video, I wanted to do a quick test to see how long it would take to make a 50% dilution of raw benzoin absolute so I can start using this in my blends. Now you can purchase or pre-purchase a benzoin absolute pre-diluted in either, you know, like benzoyl benzoate, uh, you know, anything, alcohol, anything out there. So. To save on some money, let's take a look at diluting your own Benzoin Absolute, which you can pick up like this amount right here, which is gonna last me probably more than a year. I got this for maybe 25, 30 bucks, less than that actually. And uh, we already have Perfumer's Alcohol on hand, so let's see how easy and how long this is actually gonna take. Now I've read online that some people say when you mix it in there, you wanna use heat, you wanna let it sit for a few days. But I wanted to do like a quick video time lapse to see how long this actually would take and how easy it is. So let's get started. Okay, so just a quick test on diluting raw benzoin. Uh, if you purchase benzoin as an absolute, it comes to you in rock crystal forms. So just as a test, I wanna see how it dilutes an ethanol at 50% without crushing the rocks whatsoever. I just put it in there. so. Just did a small batch to test, five grams of benzoin rock with five grams of ethanol. And it's only been about five minutes and already the color's turning nice golden brown, but you can still see the rocks are pretty large. I didn't bother crushing up any of the rocks, really. I just dumped it, dumped it in. I just want to see how long this takes uh, without any heat treatment and just throwing it in some ethanol and see what happens. So let's see how many days this takes. Okay, so just as a quick update, it's only been probably an hour, hour and a half, and you can see it's already dissolving quite nicely in ethanol with no heat, and most of the rocks are pretty much already dissolved, with, except for those two large chunks, so we'll check back in, I don't know, one more hour and see where we're at. So we are now roughly at about the two hour mark. And as you can see, everything pretty much diluted fine, except for that one little tiny rock that's just being stubborn. So I would say he'll be gone in the next 30 minutes. And there is, if you can see there, a small, oh, let me see if I can get there, that small little black, two little small black floaty things, little contaminants which is fine. I mean, natural benzoin rocks are gonna have some other little things on it, so I can either filter that out, or I can probably just grab some tweezers and just tweeze them out. But yeah, I'd say that was a pretty easy, successful test, showing that taking just raw benzoin rocks and dumping them in ethanol, 50% dilution, uh, no heat, just letting it sit there and just swirling it maybe every 45 minutes like this it dilutes it just fine. So yeah, there you have it. So after a little time, there it is, the finished product. Nice and clear, beautiful color. Benzoin Absolute in 50%. This is what it came in. Yeah, that was easy, super easy. All right, so that was it, quick and easy. That was a lot easier than what I expected. Um, probably some tips in the future. Uh, since this was just a quick test of doing it with you know, unbroken rocks, uh, to speed up some time maybe, because even though this happened really quick, I got this done in less than three hours. Uh, to speed up some time, I probably will just take like a rubber mallet or something to smash the rocks into even smaller pebbles, because it seemed like it was the, the larger ones that took the longest time to kind of finally dissolve into it, but it still went really quick. 
Uh, so yeah, so that was just a quick and easy video to show you guys. It's really easy to dilute your own uh, Benzoin Absolute. Until next time.